Hi guys, so how are you? I know today I actually look alive, Lord have mercy. So I have on my new shirt that you guys see in my Burks haul. Um, I actually like this. I usually don't like lower cut shirts, but it's actually not that low. So I actually like this and I love the way it looks. I think it's like perfect for fall. And so, I don't know, I just really like it. So I got me like this new curling iron. It's like a bigger barrel, but my hair is still a little short. So it doesn't work the way I anticipated it, but I'm thinking of getting some extensions. Make my hair look longer. The power of putting hair in there. Anyways, so I don't know what is wrong with this piece, child, but you need to lay it down. Be glad I ain't got no hairspray up in here. Okay, so anyways, I wanted to get on here and show you guys something that I got in the mail um, that I ordered myself. Um, I was so excited when it came back in stock. Um, I love watching her channel, and everybody knows Jaclyn Hill on YouTube. I know some people have their own things, but you know what? Haters are going to hate, and it's okay. You know what I'm saying? Jaclyn Hill, you do you, girl. You do you, girl, because I love watching you. So anyways, everybody's going to have their say and whatever. So I love her. I love watching her, and I was so excited to see her palette come back in. I've been wanting it, but I've kind of just like been hesitant because I don't wear makeup that often, so I don't like to go out and splurge on a whole bunch of makeup, even though I like makeup. But I just don't, I'm so impatient to sit there and do this and this and this. And then sometimes I get in the spurt like I did today and I did my makeup. So it's just kind of how I feel, I guess, kind of thing. But I am more into skincare. That's where I tend to spend my money is in skincare. I love it, especially the older I get and things like that. So anyways, I've been trying some different products. Hopefully this angle is like not crazy or maybe I'm off angle. I don't know. Anyways, so I got, as you guys seen from the picture, I got Jaclyn Hill's palette. Yes, girl. Yes. And so this is what it looks like on the back. I am wearing it today. I kind of tried to follow something she did where she did like a little bit of like a um, purplish auburn kind of color on the outer eye here. And you guys know that my skill is not that good. Okay. Because I don't wear makeup. But I did do like eyeshadow under the eye. And I did put um, mascara under the eye as well. Like the bottom eyelid and I usually don't do that because the older I'm getting I just don't feel like I want to do all those steps like all the contouring I do bronze but I don't do all the contouring all the highlighting all of that stuff because one I don't have time to do all that and two I don't want to okay so anyways I was excited to get this because this really fit the colors I love I am a bronze brownish nude eyeshadow kind of gal I don't do bold crazy colors because then I feel I look odd and I don't do it right. So I just don't mess in it. So I was excited when this came back into stock. So the only thing is, is the colors are not in the palette. As in, you don't know the colors. It does come with a color card. And so this is what the palette looks like. The same as, you know, on the box. And it looks like this on the back, which I already got something on it. So, yes, I did. Anyways, it comes with a card that looks like this. And then here are the colors that it comes with. And I'll try to hold it up as close as possible. So you guys can kind of see that these are the names of the colors. And it does go from this way. This starts at the beginning of the palette and it does go this way. So the colors you see will be the colors that you see in the palette going exactly that way. And as far as I know, she created these colors. These are not the colors that Morphe originally had. So these are actually brand new colors exclusively for her palette. So when you open it up, it does come with like a little protector thing that I just kept on there. Um, it says, this palette is dedicated to all my loving subscribers. I am one of her subscribers. I absolutely love her. So this is what it says. And, and then these are the colors. As you guys can see, if I can put it back. As you guys can see, I've already been dabbling into those and the colors I've kind of been in. Um, my favorite colors are really these neutral colors here. And I usually use, I would say... I've been using this one and this one here. Excuse my nails. I'm about to actually go get them done. But I've been using these two for like transition shade, kind of getting on my lid to give my lid some color so that my other eyeshadows will blend nicely. And then I kind of start going in with these darker colors here um, and start slowly kind of building in the outer of my crease because like I said, I don't like crazy bold colors, but I do like the colors I use. And then I kind of dabbled into... Um, these two colors just to darken up my outer um, edge and then this for my eyelid and then I kind of put that in the middle so you guys can kind of see where I've been playing these are a little bit out 
of my box and these here they're getting a little too dark for me but they are gorgeous gorgeous colors if you guys want to see this swatched let me know down in the comments below and i will do a separate video where i swatch every one of these eyeshadows so you guys can see hands down how pigmented these eyeshadows are they do have a little fallout but that's normal with basically any eyeshadow you get i'm i'm serious like i don't i don't care what eyeshadow you get there is some sort of fallout. There is a little fallout, but what I do is I dip my brush in because they are so pigmented. I dip my brush in and I literally tap off just a little bit because this stuff, you guys, it's pigmented, really. Like, it, it's crazy. So, especially these darker colors. Um, I did have, you can see a mark here. That's where I swatched that. I haven't used it, but it is crazy pigmented. That's actually what got on my palette right here. So I absolutely love these. I think they're gorgeous. If this is your range in the darker tones, I like that she included lighter neutral colors for everybody. You get a black, you get a little bit of bold colors here, and then you get kind of the darker neutral colors and things like that for everybody's taste. I feel like this palette is honestly a range for everyone. No matter what your taste is, you get a range of everything, not just neutrals, not just um, darker colors, not just bright colors, not just metallics, but you get a range of everything. And I think that it's super gorgeous. It was $38, but I mean, you get what? Let's see, two, four, wait, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And you got one, two, three, four, five. So you get 35 shades in here for $38. That's only a little of over a dollar a piece per shade. That's, hello guys, come on. We've paid more than that for like five shades, okay? Hello, naked palettes. You get like, what, seven? Something like that for like 50 something dollars. So I feel like this is a great buy. It's pigmented. It really supports her. Not only that, it's a great beginner palette because you're getting a range of colors and things like that. So if this is that kind of thing for you, then this would be for you. But I just want to show you guys that I got and that I actually have it on my lids today and I absolutely love it. Like I said, if you want to see a swatch um, of all of these colors and just kind of see how they swatch, let me know down in the comments below and give this video, video, sorry, a big thumbs up and I will do that for you guys in another video. I'm not going to do it in this one because it would be so long. But yeah, if you guys want to see that and kind of a better review, let me know. And if you guys want to see some makeup looks or something, I may try to start doing that. I am not as talented as some of these ladies here on YouTube, but um, I'm more of just a collective person. <laughs> I do like wearing makeup, but I really just need to practice more um, to where I am comfortable where I can do more makeup looks. So yeah, let me know down in the comments below. I hope you guys are having a great day, a fantastic day. And like always... See you guys next time. Bye.